objective to capacitors. In the first question, it is asked that uh, capacitance does not depend on which of the following parameter. Obviously, it doesn't depend on the charge on the plates. Though it is defined as Q by V, it is independent of both. It depends on uh, shape and size of the plates and the separation between them. And also, what is the medium which is stored in between the plates. For further clarifications, you can just watch the video of capacitors. I have explained every concept in that also. So the second is when a dielectric slab is inserted between the plates of an isolated charge capacitor. As the capacitor is already isolated, it has no connection from the circuit or the battery. So the charge on the plates will be same. It will not be able to exchange any charge from any because it is not connected to any of the part of the circuit. By Whereas by uh, putting the dielectric capacitance will change so the potential difference according to q equal to cv will also change you can just have a look at the solution that this isolated capacitor q has to be constant in the next part uh, there is a dielectric slab which we inserted in the in between the plates charge on the capacitor is q and induced charges we can say that the induction can never be greater than the original charge uh, you can have a look at the result that let q dash be the induction charge and q is the charge on the plate this is the metal plate and we can say that the charge on the induced charge which is induced on the metal plate will be this q dash which is given by this as k is greater than 1 q dash has to be has to be less than q you can remember this by a statement Induct induced charges can never be greater than the original charges because of which induction has taken place. So in the next example, there's a uh, charge. Each plate of parallel plate capacitor has a charge Q. And now the capacitor is connected to a battery. We have to find what will be the final situation. We can say the initial situation will be like this. Uh, for further clarification, you must watch uh, a video called uh, Parallel Plate Capacitors and uh, Parallel Plate System also in electrostats in this. So when the, there is no battery, the total charge will reside on the outermost surfaces and the inner side charges will be zero. So we can say uh, that when the battery is connected, these charges must be positive and negative, equal and opposite, and they should be equal to CV. This will be plus CV, this will be minus CV, but the outer charges will remain same. The battery will just take a plus CV charge from this to this plate, so the final charge will be as shown in the diagram. When the battery is connected, this final situation will be like this. So let's look at the next question. Question number. four then five uh, the separation between the plates is increased and we have to find that which of the following quantities will not change the as the plates are already disconnected the plates are isolated so the charge on the capacitor will remain same whereas when we increase the capacitance or when we increase the separation capacitance will decrease so the potential difference you can have a look at that uh, capacitor is isolated so charge will not change field which is q by a sigma by epsilon naught and it will also remain same energy density will also remain same whereas the remaining two parameters which is q as c decreases as c decreases v will increase and energy which is q square by 2c q remains same c decreases energy will also increase in the next question there's a parallel plate capacitor which is connected 